Okay, how's it going guys? Connor is here and welcome back to some more Pokemon Reborn. Yes, the new year and old Let's Play, I guess. So anyways, yeah, we're back with Pokemon Reborn. We're going to be continuing this series. Um, so uh, yeah, uh, this is where I left off, apparently, uh, against this guy. Uh, I don't know what I did since the last time I recorded. When was the last time I recorded? I don't even remember. It's been a while. It doesn't say there. It probably said on the opening screen, but I didn't look at it, just kind of hopped into the game. But uh, yeah, here's our team. I kind of looked back at the previous episode to kind of see what was going on. Apparently we weren't ready for this gym. I don't know if we are now. But uh, we'll, we'll try it again, and we'll see where we stand. So it's a poison gym. We have Creeper, Todd, they can handle poison types. Soundwave, not so much. 420, not so much. Creeper, no, not at all. And then you... Why are you with the back? Just because you're weak as shit until you evolve? Probably. It has Levitate, which will get... I mean, maybe if there's like a poison water... Scrub poison water? Because if it is, it'd be better to have Slick out front. I don't know if it's poison water type or it's just poison. It'd be better to have him fight that so we don't have to use Creeper up front. Let's try that. Let's go ahead. Do we have potion? Okay, I was... Okay, shit. I pressed enter when I meant... Okay, I was trying to look at my bag. Whatever, I guess we're starting. Uh, we already read this last time, so I'm not going to go through it again. Alright, here we go. Oh boy. So we're levitate, so we won't get poisoned at least. So let's, first off, let's just make sure it gets paralyzed by thunder waving. That's just to guarantee it so we don't just hope we get lucky. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. Okay, I read the wrong field thing. Okay, because there's two poison ones. There's like corrosive. There's corrosive field and then corrosive mist field. I thought this was, I didn't know which one to look at, so I looked at corrosive field. Apparently it looks like we're in corrosive mist field. I guess just any Pokemon gets poisoned. We have levitate, so if it was just corrosive field, we shouldn't have gotten poisoned because we're not touching the ground. That's a problem. I was hoping we wouldn't get poisoned, but whatever. We'll take out the scroll for you to heal. You're not gonna heal. Okay. So scrub down. You can bring out like a ground type or something. No, you can bring out Krogon. Okay, it's fighting. Creeper should one-shot it. Fighting poison. Ah, he has Sucker Punch. Well, at least he's not Dark type. If he was Dark type, would be a little more worried. Alright, so that thing's down. Get poisoned again. Oh, a Dark type Skun Tank. Send out Todd. Everything we have is going to get poisoned. Everything we have. Mud shot. So this is all we know. Those three Pokemon. We don't know anything else of what he has. We're going to hit him one more time. Or not. We're going to hit him a couple more times because he has to heal. With Druin Tomb, what typing are you? Whatever it is, it's gonna die. He sent this thing out just to die. Are you poison water too? Now, this is Gen 7. I don't know much about Gen 7, so. Oh my god. Can I just hit this thing? Thank you. Jesus, Todd's gonna die to the poison. He sends back out. Okay, send back out the sun tanks. So we're gonna heal. While we have the chance. I think all we have are supers. We have regulars, but it's not going to help us. Super potion up. This thing can't do much damage to us, so that's fine. It's doing little bitch damage. One more of those should hit it. Is this his ace, or does he have something stronger than a skunk thing? This is, this is his ace. I mean, we're fine. That's not his ace. Okay. Need arena. There's no way that's the ace. That's... is that ground type yet, or is it just pure poison? I don't know. Uh... What do you know? Do you have anything that'll, like, weaken their stats? No. You have Growth, Mega Drain, Acid, and Poison Powder. Poison Powder's not gonna work. Acid's not gonna work. We can Growth to raise our own stats? It's not gonna work. Huh. At least you won't get poisoned. 
I'll just send him out there so we can heal up some of our team. And maybe this is the ace. It's level 28 just like the skunk tank was. Let's just heal up our squad. Oh, it's gonna use Bite. Okay. How much does a Mega Drain do? Is it gonna do anything? It is gonna do... Eh, it's more than I was thinking it was gonna do. What, what if we grow? Let's grow. Probably say it's gonna raise our special. Or not. Or we're just flinch. That's fine. The 420 can take some hits. That's a good thing. It's like four hits to take him out. Maybe three. Okay, okay, can I not flinch every time? Just want to grow to raise our stats a bit. Maybe we can take him out. Who knows? We don't have an infinite amount of super potions, though. We only have 16 left, so... I have to use them wisely. It's growth again. Just keep growthing. Raise that special. We did that much off of base Mega Drain. So if we can, like, four shot it, that'd be great. Let's see what we're doing now. Yeah, see, that got good damage. And we get health back. I like this. I like this deal. Maybe before we kill it, we should, like, max out our Mega Drain to see if we can take out his last Pokemon before we kill it. Let's max out our Mega our, our special. Max out, we'll heal, and we'll try to take him out. Strategy. Gotta love it. Okay, I think six is the max. And we used four. So two more should max us out. After this, one more should max us out. This should be max. I'm not going to use another one just in case, you know, it's just a waste of a turn. So now let's heal again, because we're in danger zone right now. Prefer if you missed. Oh, thank you. And now let's Mega Drain. Oh, he missed again, so he should be at full health for whatever he has next. And we have a maxed out special. The ace, what's the ace? Crow! Of course, we spent all this time maxing out a grass type, and he brings out a flying type as his ace. God damn it. Well, we're gonna die. So we might as well just take this time to heal up Todd. Because Todd has Rock Slide, which will be super effective on a Crobat. Oh wait, you're using Vino Shot. That's neutral. I thought he was gonna use like Air Cutter or something. What? Are you not gonna one shot me? Well, it's still he's still gonna two shot me. We're not faster. But maybe if we can wait out, maybe we can like wait out these uh, these Vino Shocks here. So this is probably the strong. If he's using it right off the bat, it's probably his strongest attack. So if we like just wait out the PP on this thing. We can hopefully get him to use all of the PP, and then it'll be easier for the rest of our team. I would use Parish Song. We know Reaper has Parish Song, but he's gonna get one shotted by a poison attack, so that's not an option. It's the one time Parish Song won't help us in a poison gym. He's gonna keep healing. I don't know how I, if I want to use all of these. I don't know how much PP Vino Shock has. I don't think anyone on my team know, has Vino Shock. Uh, how much is that doing? It's doing like 50. So using a potion here should we should be fine. If we used a potion right there. It's doing like 50. -ish. Yeah. Just trying to stall him out as much as I can. Much as I can. It's probably just a waste of time. Like honestly, I probably could just take him out, but I don't know. Alright. I don't want to use too much. So I'm hoping that's good enough. Todd's kinda like that's 
go to Creeper first and just see if we can side beam him. Uh, that's not good. One shot, two shot. Okay, it's a two shot. Just live one attack, Creeper. Just live one attack. You lived one attack. Thank you. Okay, that was probably all for nothing. <laughs> I did all that for nothing. Okay. Easy does it. Easy does it. There we go. And so everything is vanished. Yes, it is. Savor this victory. For every joy, bitter misery rushes after. You're not going to end me, are you? No, you'll just toss me over to the police. I have a better idea. The most succulent idea I've had in years. Come to Barrel Bridge, Mark. Oh god, I remember this. I did play this game before, obviously. I, I was on my old channel, I played this before, so I know what's gonna happen here. This is something that you don't forget. <laughs> Whatever answers you desire, I'll give you there. You know, this is something we are not gonna forget. Alright, well, let's go get healed, then we'll go to Barrel Bridge, if I remember where that's at. Because again, it's been months since I've played this. Oh shit, hi, Absol. Well, yeah, something bad is gonna happen. I know why you're here. A disaster is gonna happen. Alright. Uh, do we have any cash on us? We have no money. Probably a bad idea to use all those super potions then. Do we have anything to sell? Not off the rip. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Right, you're done. You've served me well, but now you're free. Get lost. This gun was like, yeah, fuck you, I'm out. Aw, oh, need, need arena. That means you too, you're not special, bitch. Just cause you can fly. Get to move on. You're not wanted here anymore, so get lost already. Somebody's gonna get lucky and catch themselves a fucking crowbat in the wild. With that out of the way, I won't be needing these anymore. Corey threw the Pokeballs away. Well, he could've given them to me. Come on, man. Could've used those Pokeballs. So, Mark, what is it you want to know? Why I joined Team Meteor? I was cursed by my own luck. There was a ring. A brilliant ruby ring. I purchased it from a collector some time ago. I'm not one for jewelry, but it was the most dazzling ring I've ever seen. I decided that I would introduce that ring to what true beauty was. I promised it to my love, and she gladly accepted. It wasn't long after we were married that my wife became pregnant. We were both very excited. Back then I was happy. I was naive. My wife didn't survive Heather's birth. I was told that she died because of a mechanical error during the delivery. That wasn't all. The doctor assigned to her at some point had taken the- Oh, goddamn! Fucking savage doctor, dude, just gonna take the ring? And would not return it to me. Just did you whoop his ass? I would later learn that it had been dispatched by Team Meteor to obtain that ring. I did what I could, but in the end, I was unable to recover it. So I made a deal. I agreed to serve them as long as I was allowed to keep the ring. To me, it was the last token of our happiness. I did everything I had to in order to keep it. I was selfish. I placed my own desires above what was best for Heather. Now because of it, she's gone. Mark. That ruby ring. Heather has it now. She will be hunted for it. What's so special about this goddamn ruby ring? Please watch over her for me. I no longer have the right to call myself her father. My love, I will be with you soon. Yep. Wow. <laughs> what a moron. Who the fuck? Oh shit, it's Fern. Did that dumb wad really just throw himself off a barrel bridge? Yeah. Sucker's gone for sure. Dude, what a fucking dick. <laughs> a 
man just committed suicide in front of him. He's just like, wow, what a dumbass. <laughs> Jesus. And to think that he was the one I came all the way up here to challenge. What a waste. Huh, you beat him, huh? And he offed himself before he even gave you the badge. What a sorry excuse for a leader. Probably think I'm heartless, yeah? Yeah. Not like I knew the guy. So? Jesus. I thought his sister was the robot. I just see it as natural selection, you know? Yeah. Nature really wanted him to jump off the fucking bridge. <laughs> Jesus. So some old guy goes crazy and throws himself off a bridge. Big deal. If you're so con so concerned about him, why not just go down there and find him yourself? I'm not. I don't want to find his fucking remains. Probably splat it all over the floor. Look, he fell into the lapis ward right below us. And get there, just going north from a Paul Bridge. Like I remember where that's at. I mean, I don't see the point, but what? A what the fuck was that? Yo, Mark, look over there. That huge plume of smoke rising. I think it's coming from the North Obsidian Ward, right at the Grand Stairway. Again, I don't remember where that's at. Something's going down, and it's gonna. I'm gonna find out what it is. Later, loser. Okay, North Obsidian Ward. We have a map for a reason. Let's find out where that's at. So we're up here in Barrel Bridge. Jasper Ward. Is it like back at like the beginning? Yeah, North Obsidian. So we got to go back to like the starter area. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. Well, Fern still a dick. <laughs> he was a dick. He was a dick when I left. He's still a dick. Oh fuck, dude! I don't remember how to get how the hell to get out of this place. find our way back. How the hell did I get rid of that time in the corner? It's not even showing the right time. It's saying it's Saturday. Uh, today's Tuesday, buddy boy. I need to find out how to get rid of that timer up there. Is it like in the settings or something? Options? Text, battle scene, speech, menu, font, backup, max backup number, screen size, screen border, it's not there. Controls, down, left, up, up, action, 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 cancel menu, run, scroll down, scroll up, register, auto run, ooh, auto run, I forgot that that was a thing. Okay, is there no way to get rid of that time in the top corner, goddammit? gonna annoy me. Unless it's giving like the in-game time or some shit. I don't know. Uh not there. Over here. This way? That's Obsidia, so north of City is up here. What? More people. <laughs> All right. God damn it. Forgot that every time we get like a new bat, more fucking people show up on this goddamn bridge. Uh, you're normal. I don't even have anything for him to fight. As a matter of fact, so I guess Slick, you'll have to try to fight him yourself. Need you to evolve, buddy. I don't remember what level he evolves, but he's doing shit damage. Go to Todd instead. Motherfuck. Motherfuck, Todd. Are you really gonna do that right now? Right at this moment, you're gonna start hitting yourself in the face. This is sort of like bashing his head in the wall. Oh, god damn it. Really? What kind of luck is this? I have the worst luck when it comes to Pokemon. The worst fucking luck.
doing no damage to this goddamn Porygon. do this right now. I'm about to go. I'm about to perish on this thing, dude. I do not need this right now. I do not need you using fucking recover when I can barely do any damn. Okay, I'm perish on it. I'm not fucking sitting here watching him recover 50 times. Where the fuck are you at, Creeper? Get over here. Fucking perish on the shit of this kid. Fuck him. He doesn't deserve to live. Save you from Paris song. Fuck out of here. You lying piece of shit. God damn it, I hate Porygon. Alright, going back. By going back, I mean going here to heal. Is this a new area, or is this something where we've already been? I don't know. Either way, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this here, and we'll find out what these people are looking at in the next episode. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. Peace out.